As a beer writer, I've been to breweries across the world, but going to Budvar's Cellars is probably the nearest thing to a religious experience. There's something quite spiritual about tasting it there. When you have Tank Budvar in your pub, it's as good as getting on a plane out to southern Bohemia and making a beeline for that brewery. It's fresh, unpasteurised beer, it's vivid, it's colourful, it's primary colours. You know, we're thinking Andy Warhol in a glass. It links you with that brewery. I love it. Hi, I'm Sam, I'm a bartender at the Botanist Newcastle. We're really excited as we're getting a Budweiser Budvar tank placed in just behind me tonight. We get customers regularly coming in for craft beers, ales and lagers, so we're really excited to see what they think about this new Budvar tank. I'm really proud that we were the first bar to have Budweiser Budvar in tank beer form in the UK because it's a cult liquid really. When you have it in a kind of an installation like this, it's just a cult experience. So when I first experienced tanked Budweiser Budvar, unpasteurized, in the Czech Republic, in those incredible cellars, it blew my mind. I have no clue how I have the same experience here in England. I don't know how they get it here so perfect. The brewing methods of Budvar are perfect. You need the best ingredients. Czech hop, Moravian malt, and excellent soft water from artesian wells and time for aging for maturation. Our lager stay in cellars for 90 days. So tank beer start here. I think that to try the tank beer, that's a kind of brewing education because it's how the lager should taste. We get the toastiness, the graininess from the Moravian malts, and we also get that delicate, aromatic zart hop on the nose and also on the palate. If you want to keep the beer fresh, you have to avoid not only the oxygen, but you have to avoid high temperatures, shorten the time between the brewery and the table. When the beer is ready, it goes straight from the conditioning tanks in the brewery into an air sealed and temperature controlled tank and then is ready to start its journey. It leaves the brewery and then it's across Europe, passing Nuremberg, Frankfurt, Cologne, down through the great beer country of Belgium, crossing the channel and then it is in your pub. All this is done as quickly as is humanly possible. So the tanks installed, beer's been delivered from the Czech Republic. We're having a party tonight, so let's drink some lovely fresh Budvar. Budvar in the bottle or draft is beautiful, but when it's in the tank, the joy of it is amplified. When you get a glass of tank Budvar in your hand, you won't find a fresher beer.